Hello friends, today we're going to look at two great chargers, one for in the car and one for at home and traveling. Welcome to this new video. Those are all my videos, we will check the boxes, do the unboxing and then we'll see how it works in real life. So let's start with this one, the 3-in-1 folding multifunction charger. It comes about 35 euros on Aliexpress, you can check for the link in the video description. But if you have some vouchers or coupons or coins, you can even have it cheaper. I bought two, the first one I paid about 34 euros and the second I only paid 24 euros. So you can see it's all written in Chinese on the side. Here you can see some specifics. You can see the high quality boxing, looks really nice. Here's some description. Again, in Chinese and English. So this is your charging area. On the side you have a work indicator. You have your AirPods charging area, your power input, your watch power device and the watch charging area. So I opted for the version with power adapter. You can choose for a European or the US charger, but you can also opt for the version without power adapter. Then you have the USB-C to USB-C power cord and then you have the charger itself so you can see that it is really compact nice high quality materials So you can use it like this, you can also open it up to make it a higher stand and then you can also use the Apple Watch charger like this. Now the phone holds really well, you can see you can Turn it easily if you want. And it is pretty easy to fold back if you go traveling. Really handy, nice solution. Now I'm using this charger for a couple of weeks now and I have to say I really love it. It is discreet and it works really well. You can see that the MagSafe options do work. You have your nightstand menu as well, where you can slide through the different screens, of course. So really great. Now the watch as well. And in the back I can charge my AirPods as well. You can see the green light just went on. And now all my devices are charging correctly. So I bought it for 22 euros on Aliexpress, it came very quickly, in I think only one week, so let's see what's in the box.
the manual. A little help if you need to stick the magnetic ring on your telephone. Some clothes and this is the digital iron ring. So you have all kinds of telephones right here. So normally your Telephone is MagSafe compatible if you have, for instance, like me, an iPhone 12. And it will even work better if you use a MagSafe case. But if you use another case, you could try to work with a ring. I did so before, but it wasn't that successful. And here we have the charger itself. So I took the model with the hooks. This way it grabs on really tight on your air vent. You can see that the cable is fixed. So there's no way to undo the cable. And then you have this on or off button in order to control if your telephone should charge or not. And then you have your cigarette lighter with a USB-C entry as well. So let's install this in the car and see how it does. Now when I press the button once, it switches on or off charging. And when I long press the button, it turns off the light effect. You can see the light effect is off. When I long press again, the light effect is there again. So in standby, it is breathing. And when I charge my phone, it will spin. So now of course I have to do some cable management in order to hide this cable on a clean way. But overall it looks really nice. The phone holds up really good. I'm using both devices for a couple of weeks now and I'm really happy with it. It works really well. Note that when you're using MagSafe charging, you really will need at least a 15 watt charger. The charger that comes with it is rated 20 watts, as you can see here. If you're using a charger like the original iPad charger, it is rated only 10 watts or another aftermarket charger like this one, classical 5 watts. It will charge, but you won't have max safe charging. So keep that in mind, if you really want the benefit of max safe charging, you really need a powerful power adapter as well. For the car charger, the backlight shines with a kind of heartbeat motion. When it isn't charging, it isn't disturbing at night at all. And when it charges, it turns around. And the faster it turns around, the quicker your phone is charging. So classically, in the beginning, it will charge really quickly. And when you're up to 80%, it will charge more slowly. So if you like one of these products, 
please check my links in the video description let me know in the comments what you think about these charges or if you have any other great solutions don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you in the very next video bye bye